Good morning, YouTubers. We are moving a battery today. So this is a decommissioned telecom battery. And as you can see, it was installed in 2014. These batteries have a 10 year design life. So probably gonna last longer than that. And you gotta remember when a battery is considered at the end of its life, it only does 80% of what it did. So it means if you got a thousand amp hour battery now, it's a 800 amp hour battery, which I'd be totally happy with that. So we're moving 20 batteries. These are telecom style batteries. And uh, they call this a front access terminal or a FAT. So that's a front access terminal battery. And these would have went to the scrap yard. So it's kind of cool when one of these telecom stations gets decommissioned, uh, they sell them. Here's a, my, one of my buddies, Robert Dobson, Dobson777. Uh, do he's a gold guy. He's got a YouTube channel that's blowing up. He's buying the battery, one of my solar customers. And we are moving batteries. All right, guys, so the battery is gone. As you can see, there's just a spot, a greasy spot where the battery went set. And we are taking this battery and we're going to deliver it to my customer's house. There's half of it, and then the other half is on my trailer along with the rack. And as you can see, it's a very nice rack. These racks, if we, when we uh, when we install these on jobs, we, these things retail go for two to three grand. This is, this one's really nice. It's got breakers on both sides. So it was originally set up for 24 volt configuration, but we're going to be wiring it at 48 volts. You can see it's got the nice copper bus bars up underneath, and a ton of cabling, and uh, this guy's going to have a really nice battery for a really good price. This battery was about 3500 bucks. So that's 20 155 amp hour batteries, 48 volts, so you got five 48 volt strings, and uh, it's not hard for me to get used batteries, guys. If you are looking for a set of batteries and you're a tinkerer, there's a pallet of batteries right there. I get access to these things all the time, and a lot of time they end up just sitting until they're dead and going to the scrapyard. This one right here, looking for the date on it. Looks like a really new one. Yeah, there's, there's the date, 3-2018. So there's 48 volts right there one string so you know if you tell me what you're looking for and you're willing to wait i can ship you these batteries i've shipped all over um it's not that's not that hard to do either there's a set of north stars pure lead carbon high temp batteries here's some uh there's some really nice deca fahrenheit high uh high heat batteries some of these batteries are made to go in high heat applications also have access to different battery racks. Here's a super cool battery rack. This is made to go outside. I don't know if all the parts are here, but you might have to do something with it. This one is 10 2018, so not hard to uh, see where this would be a good battery for you. So this is Johnny Valentine with Gain Solar, doing some batteries, used battery moving. Uh, if you're looking for batteries or solar panels or systems or anything like that, contact me through my YouTube and I can get you what you need. So here's the battery. We got her all moved and got it down this basement. Anytime you're going to plan for a battery, space is always a consideration. A basement's a great place for it because it's a very temperature controlled environment. This battery is about 21 in, or 26 inches wide and you can see that there's plenty of room for another battery. And uh, next thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and uh, get the uh, Solark at some point for this system. He's already got a PV system on here. But these, these, these uh, battery racks are hard to beat as far as ease of installation and being able to break it down into small manageable components and get it through doorways. It's only 26 inches and a great deal. So if 
you're interested in these kind of things, use telecom batteries or you know, dish camp solar used products. Sometimes I get them, so message me or call me or I'll put my email address on this video.